Hi, and welcome to another video. Today we will be looking at IVMS 4200 from Hikvision. So what is IVMS 4200? It is your Windows or Apple PC software. Now this, this software allows you to remotely view your CCTV on your PC as opposed to your phone, which uses HitConnect. Uh, but also the lovely feature of this software is that you don't need a monitor for your DVR. So all you have to do is, even if it's a brand new DVR, just connect your, connect your DVR to your router and you have full control using the software on your PC. And also, obviously, you can view the footage as well. So it's a great little tool for those who, 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 who like to use your PC. And today we're just going to run through how to install the app and just a couple of basic features of the software. All right then, so the best way to get the app downloaded is just through Google. So Google IVMS 4200 and it will take you to the Hikvision website. So as you see here, for top link, IVMS 4200. Uh, there's also a link on our website. So if you go to ssrtrading.co.uk under technical support, Hikvision software links, IVMS, just click on the link here and it will take you to the page, the same page. All right, now we click on IVMS 4200 and it will start downloading. Okay, it takes a few minutes to download. Luckily, I have one saved from earlier. So let's go and load that up. So double click on that to install it. Okay. Yes, go next. Okay, we go install. Okay, let's give it a couple of minutes to install. Um, okay. So what we'll be doing is we have a DVR plugged into our router and we are going to be going to be accessing that and uh, checking out the footage and I can show you where, where to change a few of the settings. All right then, so finish this and we're going to launch it straight away. Okay. Oh, we don't need this download anymore. I'm just going to cancel that. Okay. Yeah, we can enable that. All right, we're in here. So you have to create a user. Uh, there's nothing important here. You could just put in your name. I'll put my name and password. Okay, now we log in. All right, it'll ask you for security questions. All right, then we just put in any names. It doesn't matter for now. Okay, let's go Peter. Uh, Jane and Mary. Okay, and we log in. All right then. So now we are in the main panel for IVMS. Okay, we don't need any of these. Now, first of all, we need to add the DVR. So to add the DVR to our software, we go to device management on the right here. Okay, as you see, nothing is on our software right now. So what we want to do is add. But to do that, we click on online devices. All right then. So at the bottom here, you see all our online devices. And our usual IDS DVR we use is down here. Click on the tick box and click on add. All right then. So we're just going to call it, I'll call it ID, IDS DVR. Uh, put in your username and password. Okay, add. All right then, now that our DVR is added to our software and it's online, perfect. All right then, so we want to view the footage. So we go back to our main menu and we click on main view. Okay then, now we see our DVR here on the right. So we click on here. It can be a bit slow sometimes, IVMS, just be patient. There we go. Now we have our, our camera installed outside and we can view it. And and that's our that's the live view but if you want to go to settings we can go back to our maintenance here and you've got events here for example where you can set your motion detection you've got your storage options account management uh, general system configuration there it is it's all on here so more videos will be coming on how to use this but this is this is to get you started feel free to look around the software uh, you can't really do much wrong to be honest so have a play around with it and 
I hope you enjoyed the video and that's how you use IVMS 4200 and install it on your PC. Thank you and see you next time.